Hi. Welcome to Love and Forever Evolving, where we are always and forever evolving. Hello, Virgos. Welcome back, my loves. Welcome to your love reading. I hope all has been well, Virgos. Have you been taking care of yourselves, eating plenty of fruit and vegetables, and taking care of that beautiful, sexy-ass temple of yours, Virgos, as it take care of you, my loves. Welcome back. Come on in. Have a seat. I hope all has been well, Virgos. Let's get into your messages here today, my loves. Welcome back. This week, we are focusing in on the color red. Yes, we're focusing in on our root chakra this week and stepping into our power with the color red. Yes. And shout out to the evolving spirits. Shout out to the soul tribe members. Gang, gang, I appreciate you all so much for your continuous love and support. And welcome back to our Patreon family, gang, gang. I appreciate you all as well. I definitely hope you all have been enjoying the content and welcome back to the ones that are new here virgos it is a pleasure to have you thank you for stopping by definitely if the reading here resonates with your spirit we would love to have you here part of family definitely don't forget to like subscribe and adjust your notification bell so that way you can be ready for when i go live on this platform i do go live throughout the week for all zodiac sign readings all right so that way you can come by get a check-in and see what messages your gordon angels and your ancestors have for you throughout the week week as well for those all right so let's go ahead and get into your messages let's see what's coming towards you here virgos in the month of january all right let's see what's coming towards you here for love let's see what we have here for 2023 for romance all right yes love 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 it was in the air virgos all right so let's see what we have here for you Ooh, we have the high priestess here this is count syrian this is also pisces particularly energy here all right virgos some y'all may be engaging here with the pisces here or this could also be a cancer here or a scorpio water element energy here but particularly this is a pisces energy here okay and this also tells me that you have been following your intuition here virgos or there is something here that is requesting for you to follow your intuition and use your discernment here okay so let's see what this is about here when it comes to love here for the month of january hmm mm. We have the Princess of Swords. Now, this is air energy here, Aquarius, Gemini, and Libra energy here. So you have someone that is watching you, Virgos, okay? Someone is definitely observing you at this time here. Again, this could be an air sign here, Aquarius, a Gemini, or a Libra here, or again, this Pisces here, all right? But you already know this, okay? Because anytime the... Um, excuse me, the high priestess comes out for me, Virgos, this lets me know that you already know particularly who this person is, or you kind of just got a feeling about this person here that's watching you here. Okay, so let's see more about this person that has their eyes on you. Ooh, the Ace of Swords. All right, Source said that's the truth, okay, that there is definitely someone that is observing you. There is definitely someone that has their eyes on you, and you've already kind of felt this yourself, okay? You're very intuitive here, Virgos, okay? And spirit wants you to know that there is some truth about this person or about this situation here that you are about to find out okay and i feel like it's coming from this person that maybe have been watching you here all right or have been watching your person here okay so let's see what this is about mm. Yeah, we have the nine of wands here, okay? This is also fire element here. Some of y'all, this person that you're engaging here with, that could be a fire sign here, Virgos, okay? They could be a Sagittarius here, a Leo here, or an Aries here, okay? So I feel like whoever this person is, who Virgos that you are, you know, observing or who however is observing you or even your person here, this is someone that took in your person through some burdens, okay? Meaning that this person caused you or your person here to go through some experiences experiences of obstacles and challenges things that you had to rebuild and restore in yourself okay so some of y'all this could be an ex here that's watching you here in the page of swords energy here others of you all this could be someone watching and observing your person here okay but this is someone that gave this person multiple chances okay and this person let this person down and it became very heavy on this person here and it's like now that they're able to stand on their own two feet here you're kind of like mm, 
no, I already know what my intuition is telling me about this particular person here, or this is where your person is picking up about this particular energy or ex from their past here, okay? And source said that this is the truth. Source is wanting you to be reminded of not to repeat lessons that you've already learned here from as well here, okay? Because you now know you've been following your intuition here, Virgos, okay? So keep moving forward. Yes, we're at the 10 of wands, okay? We know the 10 talks about completion, okay? Some of y'all are completing the cycle here with the fire sign here as well again this could be a sagittarius an aries here or a leo here okay some of y'all you're closing out a cycle here with the relationship here some of y'all this could have even been a marriage here this could have been your ex-spouse here someone here that again you shared a family here with for others of you all as well you have now come to the terms to realize what makes you happy and what no longer serves your highest good here okay and so now that you made this decision here and you put the burdens down here or your person did this all this person can do is just watch you i mean pretty much that's it and you know this right you know this already virgo so let's see what else here yeah we have the queen of cups here here goes that water element here okay again some of y'all this person may be a water sign here again this is particularly scorpio energy here virgos okay so some of y'all this may be a, a scorpio here that is observing you and watching you or this uh, scorpio could be the mother or the father of your child here or someone from your past here okay others of you all this could be the pisces that we mentioned here or again a count syrian here this is a water element here this is someone that you had love here for virgos you actually love this person here and for this person to take you through these burdens here this is where you cannot you know this is something that you just can't erase from your mind here you can't erase the fact that the things that they've done here towards you or how they may have portrayed you in the past or this person that you are now engaging here with they are realizing that the things that they have dealt with in their past and this is just something that they know deep down in their heart deep down in their soul that they cannot return to because they know that they've already been through this with this person this could have been over nine times nine weeks nine months or even nine years here okay and like the number 10 just put the coffin in the nail in the coffin here i feel like okay wow powerful messages here for you virgo so let's see how this particular person here feel let's see what they want to say at this time about this situation or this circumstance here all right and loves i am available for personal readings if you would love to dive deeper into the message here today definitely if this is resonating for you virgos i am now available for personal readings all that information loves is down below in the description box okay so let's see how your person feel or let's see how this particular energy that is surrounding you or your person let's see how they feel and what they want to say here okay wow we have bad health here okay so some of y'all this particular person is not in so much good health because of what they allow to happen here or take place and not being responsible and holding themselves accountable i thought this person just continuously have done this here and it because a toxic or unhealthy pattern and you just realizing this and you're having to move forward i feel like some of y'all this is not what you wanted to do but this is you know what your intuition here has telling you to do because i feel like for some of y'all this have even affected your health okay and you realize like mm -mm, Mm, no i can't continue to keep going through this type of pattern here right yeah we have i don't know how to okay so this particular person they might struggle with trying to do right or trying to commit to this relationship or the family here because of their bad ways or patterns again of doing things here okay yeah we got what the fuck okay like what the fuck virgos okay this person is like damn every time i try to commit or every time i try to do right i feel like this person fucks up or you're like what the fuck why come every time i try to give you a chance these are the results i get i end up being in bad health here i end up you know losing things or having financial issues because of this particular person and their choices that they make here and i feel like you all are now realizing this is what your intuition here with this high priestess is telling you yes i can't make this up virgos why you do that to me okay so this particular person wants to know why you do this to them virgos why did you decide to leave this person or why did you decide to remove yourself from this particular person's energy i feel like for some of y'all this was the last opportunity or the last you know cycle that you agreed to and i feel like boom once again you may have caught this person this person may have done something again here and you're just fed up with it okay because again we go from the nine to the 10 of ones here so there is definitely a completion here there is definitely a new cycle here there is definitely a new beginning and an ending going on somewhere and a new beginning coming in for most of you all yes we got the divine feminine here i could be speaking to the divine feminine here or this person here that we're referencing to is the divine feminine 
Yeah, look at that. I can't make this up. I want you back, Virgos, okay? So this person wants you back, but it's like, again, as you mentioned here, as this person mentioned, like, I can't keep doing this. My health is all over the fucking place. I can't eat right. I can't think right. I can't, you know, do what I need to do. I can't even be in a healthy environment here. And you're realizing this because it's really starting to take a, a toll on your health here or this person's health here. Yeah. And all this person can tell you, okay. And as if, as if it's enough, right? We got, you been on my mind. Okay. So this particular person here wants you to know that you've been on this person's mind heavy. Okay. Because they know what they've done here. Okay. Wow. The mother. All right. Some of y'all, you could be the mother who I'm speaking to, or this could be the mother right go of your child if i'm speaking to a masculine energy here because we have the divine feminine energy here and then we have the mother here some of y'all you could have met a divine feminine person here that is more in their higher frequency vibration and this person here that cheated or caused this mess here or is in bad health and they're very toxic here could be the mother of your child here virgos if i'm speaking to a masculine energy here oh look at this i love you okay i feel like yeah some of y'all are actually finding someone who more understands you here with this divine feminine energy here rather this woman or this female or this you know feminine energy here that has portrayed you here i see in your past okay mm -hmm. and your guardian angels want you to know that as you move forward with this divine feminine energy here or as you move forward with this divine masculine energy here know that you are safe virgos know that you are protected okay because this could be referencing to a divine feminine or divine masculine just take it where it resonates for you okay pow let's get one more message here okay yeah look at this shaking my head just sad okay so some of y'all just realizing like damn you know i really learned from this relationship i really learned from this marriage i really learned from this experience and now i know how to set healthy boundaries for myself i see that this was all just very sad and you could have been naive you could have not been aware of this person their tricks and their fucking ticks here and you're just like no i don't have time for this no more I got to get my health back balanced and I got to move forward, okay? Some of y'all, you just needed to know that one last time. You know how you get that energy like, what if, okay? So some of y'all just want to try it or give it a go one more time and this person showed themselves once again their true colors, okay? A person is who they are, okay? That's their soul. That's their spirit they got going on in them, okay? All right, and some of you all now know exactly what that is, okay? Wow, Virgo's powerful message here once again, loves. I definitely hope again the reading has fulfilled your spirit and if so, loves definitely don't forget to like subscribe we would love love again to have you here part of family again i am available for personal readings if you would love again virgos to book a personal reading all that information loves it was down below in the description box and i'm also here for all beautiful energies here that would love to extend your stay i do have a portal for patreon soul family where we will be able to have more of a one-on-one -on -one experience where i have free sessions for all patreon family once a month where we go into your birth chart we definitely pull some oracle messages for you and i do go live there for all patreon family where you do get the opportunity to have free questions each and every time I go live for all my Patreon family. And also you get all the content that I post here first, all right? So that way you get access to everything that I do provide here on this platform. Thank you all so much, Virgos, for your continuous love and support. I see you, I hear you in those comments, and I thank you all so much. All right, I definitely wish you all peace, love, and abundance, Virgos. Remember, your health is your wealth, Virgos. I love you. Mwah. Bye-bye.